try to get Angel to walk out to the car with me and take her for a ride to town. I don't believe she's really ever walked on a leash very much at all. But we're going to give that a shot. She's really good at when she doesn't want to do something, she'll lay down. Gizmo, no, you gotta stay. You gotta stay, Gizmo. But she's gonna have to fit as soon as we walk out. More than likely. There's Mr. Morris. I really shouldn't let him out. Now that A-hole is back, I can confirm they are back, unfortunately. Well, let me try to get him in the house. Here she goes. And my neighbor just showed up. He's an ally in my battle against the a-hole. He despises him probably worse than I do. Oh my god, watch out for the vicious guard dog. Freaking wind. This is gonna dry shit up. Well, I brought Angel down to the river walk area. I don't know how far. I don't know how good her stamina is yet, but. I highly doubt we're going to make it all the way back there to the river. But we'll give her a chance. Man. Crazy wind. I'll have to show you guys how much the river came up yesterday from the rain we got. I was surprised how much it rose. I don't have any water for her, though. Oh, well, she's doing really well. It's a bit chilly. You should feel special, Angel. I've never even done this with my own doggies. Recycling facility here where they shredded tires and they ended up burying a whole lot of the shredded tire material because if you come through you're like oh my god this would be great with a metal detector no it actually sucks because there's so much pieces of shredded steel belted tires here that's horrible and the bad thing is this used to be the railroad depot your train used to run right through here right through that backyard so there aren't goodies to be found. The actual train station where you unload and loaded passengers was right in this area. But you'd really be lucky to, you'd have to know your metal detector really well to find anything and all the false signals you're going to get here. think she's gonna make it. We can probably make it to there. I don't want to hear her huffing or puffing yet. Now 
she's starting to breathe a little hard. You gonna make it there, little pudge pudge? gorgeous out, but it's just not letting up. Hopefully I'm blocking the wind good enough that it's not ruining all this. We went way around the corner down there, so that's like five times longer than you've ever walked one time. So let's get in the car where it's warm because it's freaking freezing out here. You're dressed for it, but I'm not. Wow, we. We'll have to do this again some other time when it's warmer out. Alright guys, thanks for walking with us. I'll show you the river when I get home. Seemed like it rained that much here yesterday. Sure did by poles though. It was crazy how much it rained there. But this morning I looked out and I was like, okay, river's in good shape. My sticks were below the water at 8.30 or so this morning. This stick here is the highest level it got to on Sunday. dam in town is way higher than it was Sunday so I expect this might actually make it up to my fire pit by the end of the day but we have no more rain in the forecast so that's a good thing this is crazy like I said it didn't seem like it rained that much here compared to what it did last Friday and Saturday oh well we're prepared so Whatever happens, happens. Thanks for going for the walk with me and Angel. <laughs>